A battle over rent control in the South Bay. Good evening, I'm Misha DeBono. We begin tonight with residents in mobile homes across National City asking for a rent cap. City leaders voted tonight on an ordinance that would limit rent increases. And Fox 5's Liberty Zavala joins us live with the meeting that had people moved to tears. Liberty. Good evening, Misha. Well, that rent cap passed unanimously tonight, and it is a major victory for many mobile home park residents, many of whom had to face choosing between paying for their medicine and paying for their rent. Uh, the mayor of National City moved to tears as she listened to the emotional plea of mobile home park resident Sylvia Gardner. And thank you all from the bottom of my heart for listening to us and for listening to our voice. Thanks to you considering this hearing. I have some peace of mind that I will be able to pay my bills and I will be able to be um, okay with this uh, rent stabilization. Tenants at Keystone Trailer Park say they were slapped with a nearly 30% rent hike. They worry could push them out on the streets. For us to uh, have those rents low, because it's very, it's very hard these times. I really appreciate for all your help. The new ordinance will limit rent increases at mobile home parks to 5%. But owners at previous meetings say the move will hurt landlords in the long term. Well, with all your arrows that you're shooting, you hit my park too. That's only five. Thank you, Mike. The ordinance passed unanimously, and a round of applause echoed through the chamber. Cielo. But for many, like Cielo Garat Zanella, with the San Diego Organizing Project, the fight for affordable housing in San Diego will continue on. Really, this is about having people realize that they have power, that they have say in their in their community, in their city, and that they get to influence the laws. Uh, around them. And that rent cap will take effect in January of next year and will last for two years. For now, live here in National City, Liberty Zabala, Fox 5 News.